phone-based remote patient monitoring equipment and telehealth technologies have revolutionized the care of patients living with chronic conditions. In this scenario, Karen, a home care nurse, is making a follow-up visit to Michael, who suffers from congestive heart failure. She has requested a telehealth consultation with Dr. Britton about Michael's declining health. Thanks for setting up this visit. Thanks. Uh, Dr. Britton, this is Mr. Jones, and he is uh, one of um, my home health patients, and he has a history of congestive heart failure, and he's having some increased shortness of breath. So I just wanted you to take a, a look at him and talk to him, find out what we need to do next, and I'll introduce you. Hi there, Mr. Jones. Ms. Hello, doctor. Thanks for sending his uh, weights and uh, pulse oximetry for the last week. Karen, could you get a close-up of his uh, neck veins? Can you see that? Okay. Looks like he's got a little uh, JVD there. Could you get the stethoscope and let me listen to his heart? Okay. Could you put it on the uh, right upper sternal border? Like right here? Okay. I can hear that. Can you now uh, move it to the left upper sternal border? Okay, that's good. He's got an S3 gallop. I'm going to switch over to the lungs now. Can we listen to his lung bases? Yes. Okay, on the... Uh, I'm on the left. Uh, put the stethoscope left lower lung base. Okay, yeah, he's, he's got some rails. Uh, right lower lung base? That's a right lower lobe. Okay, right upper lobe? Okay, that clears out. Left upper lobe? Deep breath. Have him take a deep breath. Okay, he's clear up there. Has he got swelling in his lower extremities? Yes. I have a camera on here. I can show you that. All right. Uh, Mr. Jones, it looks like you're uh, retaining some fluid. We're going to need to increase your uh, Lasix medication. I want you to take an extra dose tonight. And uh, do that for the next couple of days. Karen, could you check on him daily until we know his breathing's better? Yes, I can do that. Okay. Thanks. Uh-huh. Thanks. Bye. The TitoCare telehealth device allows for live monitoring of cardiovascular parameters, along with diagnostic visuals as appropriate, such as skin tone and swelling. I can hear that. Okay, that's good. He's got an S3 gallop. In this case, Dr. Britton was able to clearly hear both heart and lung sounds as well as assess the patient's jugular vein distension, JVD, and any pitting edema. It has been found that telehealth can direct providers in the correct change of diagnosis and medical management.